And check it out. We got... There's a number in the corner there. You know what that number means? That's how much I died. First things first, I really need to go back to Firelink. Oh, that's the ringing sound. Howdy, Val. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Hello. All right, I've got the chat open this time. Hello, nice. Chat. Oh, hey. Speaking of chat, i got to relayer my windows. There we go. <laughs> So, yeah, I've got a new character from the last time just that I went ahead with just so uh, we wouldn't have to double up on progress. Yeah, that way you already have the things done that we're going to be going through today. Hello, Onion oh, Time. Hello, hey, Onion. Well, now it's time I do my part, huh? Just volume seven. Yeah, I'm just doing stuff around Firelink right now, like giving Grey Rat the bone. Mm hmm. Heavens. Oh, he's gonna be sad. She was already dead. Thank you. I'm not surprised, though. I don't know how many deaths we were Almost at. I kinda really, cut off really. at the end of the last stream to make pizza. You can keep them. Uh, well, I didn't die after you left. Yes. Okay, thanks, bud. <laughs> I thought we were at A seven, of thanks, including phantom deaths, because I want to include those. Okay. You can keep the ring as. Well, <laughs> Thank you, Onion. It's mixed bun from the things, chat. I suppose. Val. Val is the bun. <laughs> oh, right. I have to go away before he'll curl up. Yeah. And then you come back again and you can send him out to find things. Yes. Okay, I don't need to buy anything particularly. Oh, phone. What do you want, phone? Oh my god, no. What is this? An empty text message from a number I don't recognize with no subject. Okay. Nice. Just a test. A test message. <laughs> ah, well, man. It's good to see ye and good at what needs smithing this day. Um, I count phantom deaths because, like, it's not like you have to die if you're a phantom. You still have the choice to pre preserve yourself. It's just, uh... Ooh, yeah, reinforce that Estus Flask. It's just, like, I have a tendency to play a lot more carelessly when it doesn't feel like a real death. So I want to make it feel like a real death. <laughs> well, we you won't be uh, playing as a phantom on my it. end for a little while, because I've already made a bunch of progress with this character. Yeah, that's true. Ah. Oh, I give, give her the mortician's asses. Asses, yes. <laughs> but we already got our ass. It's in the first area. It's been sitting in that chair this whole time. Mm-hmm. I'm just dealing with a friend up in the tower. Ah, yes, the friend. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm not sure, Onion. I don't want to commit to New Game Plus yet. So, I guess for now I just I want to complete the game. I know, Shima. The craziest <gasps> game. Oh my Shima. Oh yeah, you and have yeah. like you that have a limited a amount of arrows you can carry. <laughs> and now we're talking over each other. I'm sorry. No, that's fine. That was my fault. <laughs> I'm excited to respond to chat now that I can actually see chat. Yay, that's a good thing. <laughs> but yeah, that was a Yumaniki ringtone. Oh my god, do you remember the the stream Aniki? Yeah. Last year, that was so much fun. The, oh, hello, the, you're back. Which stream? And in one piece. Wait, you can keep. I us. think that was when you broke out the the, new, oh. the witchy BRB artwork. Yes. Oh, there's so much stuff to do. Grey Rat isn't curling up either. He's like, no, I'm gonna be stoic. 
Hello, Cole. Come on. Come on, fog wall. I hate this part. Oh, that's nice. I'm a little sad you got rid of the LP because it was really sort of relaxing to listen to, but I can understand why. Uh, do you mean Scholar? No, the Yume Niki one. Wait, did I get rid of it? I think so. Mm. You kept the, the stream up and you completed the game on that. But... Oh, right. Yes, yes. You're correct. I had forgotten. <laughs> like, oh yeah, I tried to do a Let's Play of that before... for the stream. Hawkwood out here now? No. It's too soon for that. <laughs> um, I, I'm gonna try and do a Halloween stream. I don't know if it'll be, like, on the night itself, because I might actually have something else to do. But, uh, sometime around then, definitely. Actually, I guess I should ask you now, Val. Uh, would hmm. you be interested in joining in for Dot Flow? Because it's oh, cool. a lot scarier and gorier than Yume Niki was, so I don't know Spooky if you'll be up for that. Again. Yeah, I'll be up for that. Yeah? Sweet. Oh, totally. Champion of Ash. All right, let me know where Welcome. you want to meet and when. Okay. This Cause I think the next progress Dead one is the Road of Sacrifices. Hardly deserves to be Are we there already? I think so. That's the next uh, area and past the, the Great Tree. Oh my goodness. Your mm -hmm. I thank you dearly for this and assure you of my leal service. Yes, does you will. This is some Dark Souls 3. Hi, Des. Then shall we begin? Okay, I'm getting Hello. my first level up from of the dark side. What, whatever his face Let is. Turtle dude. Turtle friend. Oh, the pilgrim. Yeah. Oh, I need to check a thing at Firelink that that reminded me of. The funny thing is, if I want to get all these level ups and get the ending I'm going for, I'm gonna need to die a lot more. Be mm -hmm. safe. I kind of panicked on my first playthrough when I got hollowed a whole ton. Yeah, kind it of... is kind of out of nowhere, or seemingly. Um, after the thing with the pilgrim happens, what's the uh, trigger for making the next NPC appear there? Do you have to be embered or unembered? I think you just need to buy the tome. Like the, the Tome of Londor. Where do you buy that? From the Pilgrim? Hold on. He's dead already. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think my game is a little out of order. Oh well. This isn't my main character, so it doesn't really matter. It's hard to do these things, things in order, to be honest. It is. Okay, no, uh, Yuria should appear after Yol dies. Okay. She has not, so I don't know. It doesn't matter. Hey, Earth Machine! Thanks for hosting, dude! Oh, thank you, Earth. What? Hello to Earth's viewers. What? Why do we want to move the chat to the old place? Then it gets in the way of the loading screen. <laughs> so everything's off to the right, or to the left. It fits nice and snug in between the UI elements. Yeah. Uh, I currently have no plans to play the Bioshock collection. Heavens, she was already dead. There we go. I got curl up. Heavens. Aww. Curl up and nap time. Mm -hmm. Well, you get nap time from another person. Oh, that's right. Oh, I haven't even done... I, I think I might have to go do that, actually. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm making no you wait. 
<laughs> I'm doing other things. That works. Oh, Earth Machine's saying you have to get Yuria before a certain point in the game. Okay. I wouldn't think you're past that yet, though. Because I'm pretty sure it's a lot later that the well, quest progresses. She hasn't shown up yet, so it doesn't matter. I kind of numed ahead with this character. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is really hard to keep all the side quests going in proper order in this, even more so than other Dark Souls I've found. Yeah. Uh, I never got to play are. the first two there. Bioshocks you know that I'm much. A thief. Well, perhaps I'll go on the prowl. Everyone's dead or hollowed away anyway. I might as well fetch some weapons or treasure for you. Well, yes, Grey Rat. Go pillage. You. Grey Rat <laughs> the Thief was once a well-known name until I ended up rotting in a cell. <laughs> Aw. Oh man. Yeah, whatever. This it's like side quests. They're nice, but they're also kind of mean. A little. This game is kind of mean. It's very mean. Yeah. Not as mean as the second game, in my opinion. Um, I would say that depends if you're playing Scholar or not. I don't know. There were some areas I found easier in Scholar. I I cannot understand that. But <laughs> I mean people play games differently, so I suppose. It's all good. Yeah. All right, I got to go find Sigurd and help him fight a demon. Yes, which is There's also some nifty items in that area. Oh my goodness, who's texting me now? What? Apparently I've got to go bring in groceries. Oh no. Uh, having food is nice. Sorry everyone, i got to do a quick BRB. <laughs> I'll watch over the chat in your absence. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I kind of imagine Estes to sound kind of, or taste kind of like a sort of citrusy tea. <laughs> well, Shima's st still here, so it won't be that chaotic. <laughs> Hello, she's a fiend. You came back at Agent is bringing groceries in time. Oh, if you can, you should make a sandwich, Earth Machine.
Hello. I'm fairly drowsy at the moment, so I don't know how entertaining I'm being, but yes, I'm here in agent's absence. I'm also kind of multitasking, so... Cats are always necessary. Yes, more cats! <laughs> oh, that's not the right screen. That's the right screen! Yay! So I've got to go to the end of the rainbow, and that's where I'll find my friend. Yes. It's giving me a bit of a chance to practice with the claymore, too. It's like, what? A weapon? How does this work? This character is using a claymore as well. Nice. Very similar weapon to the claymore. Are you saying the claymore is similar to the claymore? Ow, ow. It's sort of like a square claymore, if you know the weapon I'm talking about. Uh, is it the Executioner's Sword? Yeah. Okay, I guess I do know. <laughs> it's kind of... It's just, it's just a square... length of metal with sharp edges. <laughs> yeah, like a sharpened metal bar, essentially. Mm-hmm. Kind of funky looking. Yeah, I definitely want to try more cool strength weapons too. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it can't really be infused because it's got a special effect attached to it. Oh. Yeah. All right, buddy. Now you're all excited about having a saw blade. Excited. My goodness, I'm not using my shield nearly enough. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, really? I wasn't aware of that. I did see that they changed the uh, dexterity requirement for the Claymore in the recent patch. Oh, did they lower it? They raised it. It used to be 1610, and now it's 1613. Oh, so it is. You can tell how much I've used the Claymore. <laughs> womp. Hit my table. Womp, womp. Hmm. Two Estus flasks. Let's do this. I kind of like what my character looks like now. Like a badass? I've got the original, like the black leather armor, the original thief armor from Dark Souls 1. Ooh, nice. That's always been my favorite thief mm. armor. Mm -hmm. It's got cape physics now. Oh, don't disappear. I didn't even think of that. Downright worry. Thanks to you, an epiphany has struck me squared in the head. I've unraveled the riddle of this inscrutable lift. <laughs> but yeah, this character is a shieldless big sword character. The tower. Nice. You are much braver than I am. <laughs> not exactly sure what happened. Anyhow, do you see that? I might try that using a parry dagger as well. I'm no coward, I'm a steady Yeah, do it. 
That thing makes my skin crawl. Now, now, think twice before you go down that road. Yeah. What's that? Think twice? Fuck it, I'm going. <laughs> I also looked at some of the equip load. It's sort of the same as Dark Souls 1, where it's 2550, but there's also in between points, but they're, they are static, so. Oh, okay. There's no weird curve that you get from raising another stat, like adaptability from Dark Souls 2. Thank goodness adaptability is gone. Ooh, I love the parry animation with the parry dagger. It's all turny. Super fancy. All right, all right. What the heck is this thing even doing? Aside from kicking my ass, I mean, but well, that's obvious. That's very useful at time, since I'm sort of a low weight. So having infinite poise during attack animations is a very good thing. I'm eventually going to be using a very interesting boss. Oh, so you have a build in mind. Hmm, sort of. Sort of a rough build. Come on. Stop. No. It keeps walking out of my attack range. All right. That makes sense, I mean. Oh. I guess it makes yep. sense, but... I love my two-handers. <laughs> I'm gonna be big and smashy. Smashy's always good. <sighs> we did it! We fought that the demon! Quite a performance. But you mustn't get in yeah. over your head. We uh, unkindled must put our I don't think you can summon me in that area either. But no, moment, yeah. We Remember it blocked me. you from being able to enter the elevator shaft at all. Your valor, mm -hmm. my sword, and our victory together. Okay. I have Long may the sun 450 <laughs> throwing knives, so I'm set. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, I'm going to have myself a little nap. The only thing to do, really, after Three. a nice toast. Only seven. I could go grind for those. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. There we go. I got all of his emotes. Yay. Oh, uh, like... He's so great. <laughs> I love Sleepy Onion Friend. Sleepy Onion Dad. Yeah. Though, I don't know if he's technically a dad in this game, but he still acts very daddish. Very dadly. Yeah, there's not a whole lot of items in this area, is there? I'm making a fool of myself now. Yeah? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Luckily, I'm not embered, so... Ah, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. I like that you still gain more hollowness in this without losing health. Mm-hmm. It's just a, a neat visual effect. Mm-hmm. Like you said last time, I think, more of a more of a lore thing than an actual gameplay penalty. Yeah. <laughs> I... Also, this item at the end of the hallway is just, just the most spectacular joke. Chat, you'll see why in just a moment. I don't know which one you're referring to. You know, where the, the cage enemies are hanging, and at the end of the hallway it's just some alluring skulls. Oh. <laughs> And then there's these, like, tree people who are just sitting in their chairs, having a nice time watching the sunset. Yeah. Not allowed. Nothing is nice in this world. It 
it's a big sword. So. That's true. That's nice. Big swords are a girl's best friend. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, this is a chest. Oh, I'm sad that there isn't like a blind bottle weapon. That would be perfect for your character. Uh, say again. I'm sad there isn't a wine bottle weapon in this game. That would be perfect for your character. <laughs> oh. Yeah. More joke weapons. More golf clubs. Oh, oh, double missionaries. I forgot about this. <laughs> Run away! Oh, those ones, yes. Welcome to heck. Do they drop anything? Can I just skip them? <laughs> That's no worries, Onion. It's just very useful info. Thank you. Part of what makes this game good is that you can just kind of do your own thing. There's a lot of room for conduct and just playing for fun. But info always helps. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot that blessed weapons are actually kind of important in this one, too. Those old catacombs there. Mm -hmm. Alright, here's something I never knew about before. I had to watch a video to find this shortcut. You know where you uh, jump off the building onto the stone tower? Oh yeah, if you jump down you can get a very interesting armor set too. Let's see... I got a homeward bone. Yeah, on the inside of the tower there are little... Uh, footholds you can jump onto. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is dangerous. I'm completely out of Estus. Oh, no. Are you Embered? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you can't use Embers to heal yourself if you're already Embered, unfortunately. Hey, Chloranthi Ring! Yeah! And the Mirror Vest! That's right! Mm -hmm. Oh, sad that times. That was what I was... That's what I was wearing when I before I switched to the the seat set. Okay, is that everything out of here? I think so. Now I have to go down the elevator to get to the road of sacrifices, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, in other words, I am on my way to meet you. Okay, I will be there shortly. Ooh, Josephine, marshmallows are always a good idea. Mm-hmm. Also, I think I forgot to burn my bone shard, which I really need to do at this point. Mm -hmm. It's like, a chug of Estus is about a quarter of my health now. Yeah. Right, all right. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what uh, Frostbite does in this. Uh, as far as I know, it does a little bit of extra damage and also reduces your total stamina. Or reduces okay. whoever is being hit by the effect's total stamina. I've heard it also increases certain types of damage resistance. Increases so like or decreases? Increases. Oh. Okay, my uh, summon sign is down. Oh, wait, hang on. I need to go buy the soapstone. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even have the soapstone yet? That's funny. Nope. I just kind of rushed this character through. <laughs> Speaking of rushing, oh my goodness, everybody's throwing pots at me. <laughs> Run! No puppy, no. Now it's not the time. Bad pupper. Mean pupper. Oh no. Quickly on the elevator. I'm going the wrong way. Okay. 
That makes sense, kind of. Yeah, it was kind of like, oh, we need a new effect for the new game, but they couldn't really think of anything, so they just kind of made bleed plus or bleed minus, depending how you look at it. I don't know, maybe the, uh, maybe their big pots are full of things that smell nice. So when they're not fighting, they just sit there and smell it, and they're like, mmm. <laughs> That's what I do with a giant pot. <laughs> uh, hmm. Hmm. Are there, would there be any reason you wouldn't be able to put down a summon sign somewhere? If you're being invaded? That's my I only thought. Edward. Did it just mean hollowed perfection? No, no. Oh, uh, uh, am I gonna die here? I am at the first bonfire at the Road of Sacrifices, and I cannot put my summon sign down. Hmm, I know there are some areas you can't put it down in, but I didn't think that was one of them. Okay. Oh my gosh. It happened. Gotta iterate that death counter. <laughs> okay, Onion's saying the first half of the Road of Sacrifices cannot be done co-op. Right, this, oh, gotcha. this game has weird restrictions on co-op. It's like, you can't do it in this place because we said so. Oh man. What a waste. Oh, the crabs. Oh, the crabs! Right now. I missed the first item they're guarding. Yeah, sometimes with those crabs, I just like leave and come back. Because <laughs> they're really a pain to deal with. If you okay. know how to dodge their attacks, you can get them stun locked and then do a uh, finisher move. Oh, that's true, yeah. There's one crab that's really fun to fight, though. Just because you don't actually have to fight it. Oh my gosh, you guys. Stop following me to the elevator. So, <laughs> Onion's saying the crab part is where we can start doing co-op again. Yeah, I saw that. So I will wait for you to get through that. Yeah, Clean up on my end. Oh goodness. I'm fighting the dudes with trees. Oh, they're the worst. Oh my gosh. Forgot just how much I hate those enemies until right now. Oh gosh, yep. Yeah. They can, like, double up on you. Fuck off! Holy shit. If I'm lucky, I can get one attack in. Well... You know what the problem is? I'm not just using the long sword. That's basically oh, hard mode knights. for this game. Yeah. The long sword is kind of the best weapon for some reason. I mean, I feel like that's always been the case in Dark Souls. Uh, but the first Dark Souls, I'd say the Alder sword is better than the long sword. You know, that's a good point. But it's still kind of like the generic straight sword. Yeah. It's just in this one, the other weapons are just so severely underpowered compared to it that mm -hmm. it's even better than it was. 
That's true. That's probably my biggest complaint about this game. I feel... Some people say it encourages build diversity, but I kind of feel the opposite. I think it's, like, the best you can master easily. Not necessarily, technic necessarily technically the best weapon. Oh, well, maybe. But it's the easiest to master, for sure. It feels like anything that swings even a fraction of a second slower just can't get attacks in. Because everything else attacks so damn fast. But I guess I just yeah. gotta get good, right? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. And if, in that case, I think the long sword being there is kind of nice, because then it's just, it's a fallback. It's a way to make sure you can handle any situation. Yeah. Yeah, that's right, never stop attacking. Uh, I'm covered in crap saliva. There we go. I killed it. Now I can move on. It kind of depends on the weapon you're using as well. Like, great swords can, like, sort of lift up enemy shields if you hit them, and they don't bounce off. Uh, that's true. Hi, Raid Lord. Yep, I'm streaming on a Monday. Oh yeah, the Conjurer set. That's like the original Pyromancy set. I thought that was just the Pyromancer set. Nope. The Pyromancer set in this game is different than the Dark Souls 1 Pyromancer set. Oh, interesting. Mm-hmm. It's got like a sort of headband that changes depending on gender. Alright, I'm making my way through the Road of Sacrifices now, hoping not to become okay. one. <laughs> oh, sorry, the Conjurator set. Conjurator? Yes, that is how it's spelled. Okay. <laughs> Your conjuring skills are, mm, I'd say, a seven and a half out of ten. Mm. That's, oh, that's I a joke. Be fighting this, this one enemy. <laughs> Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh, storyteller staff. That... <laughs> I just found a troll message. <laughs> Hidden path ahead, and it actually kind of looks like it, but I know that's a death drop. Uh, is it the one under the bridge? No, it's... Uh, like, you know where those two upturned carts are? Oh, yeah. Just past that and past the tree. Yeah, that's a death drop. <laughs> this, however, is totally legit. Going left from the the harpy mage. Mm hmm That doesn't look safe.
Ooh, Brigand Twin Daggers. I've never played with those much. They do have the the bandit knife. Super step. Which I believe has more invincibility frames than a dodge roll. Or at least as many as the fastest dodge roll. Oh yeah, and they're really good for getting through the swamps because you can use that without mana, and it still makes you move oh. super fast. Really? Yep. I thought it used mana. It does, but you can use it without mana, is what I'm trying to say. Okay. Wait, that's the spot where I get Claranthi plus two? Is that a new game plus? Because that's... I mean, I'm not really doing that right now. Yeah, I don't have cat ring yet. No meow meows. What are you trying to say, Onion? Is it there right now? Oh, it doesn't say ring ahead. I'm going to check that out myself. It is an NG plus two, okay. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't want to jump down again, because I'm like, I'm running out of Estus as it is. Uh... Okay, I remember this part I just cheesed with a bow, but I don't really have a bow right now. Piss him off and then run away! Yep. <laughs> No. Uh, uh, okay, yeah, you can just dive into the pit. <laughs> Sweet. I'm still trying to figure out why the first half of the wouldn't be co opable. I don't know. Maybe it's just a thing where they're like, oh, we don't want you to co-op through the entire game. So we're going to block off some areas. But that's silly. Why would you want to co-op through the whole game? Yeah, I don't know. I'm not saying, like, it's a good idea, but that's just <laughs> the logic as I understand it. Yeah. Oh, she was saying because it counts as a transitional area. Hmm. That's... Do I have to jump off the bridge here? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> the Dark Souls equivalent to a hallway. You can't summon in the hallway, it's too cramped. There's no room for two players. What? This dog's really I have fat. have orbs now. You have orbs? Yes. Fire orb. Ooh, sweet. Love those forbs. Mm-hmm. Do wings r Wow. Do rings weigh in this game? And the answer is yes. Yeah. Apparently I've still got a super fast roll, even at 64% equip. Hmm. Or maybe it's not technically the super fast roll. Probably not. It's... It looks like the fast roll from Dark Souls 1, though. Where you, like, leap forward and do the really quick roll. 
You can definitely roll faster under 25. So, let's see. Okay, I think I get less distance if I'm over 60. 50. The rolls all kind of look the same. Except for the fat roll. It's still a fat roll. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Val! I made it! Okay, I'll be there in a second. Okay, I'm just gonna talk to these peeps. Yep. The Gur man. Yo! <laughs> I like Horus. He kind of belongs in Banjo Kazooie, but he's pretty great. <laughs> Okay, my summon sign is down. I should show up as needy at this time. Alrighty. We are well along the road of sacrifices. Below us is the crucifixion rules. Oh no! Lies the microwave betrayed you. The undead legion. Further yet is the cathedral of the deep. We seek the Sounds like your burger patty needs some more, uh... I was gonna say sawdust, but I mean breadcrumbs. <laughs> Please don't eat sawdust. Same difference. <laughs> One may find the other in a time of need. May the flames guide your way. Okay, just oh, yes, shift and up the... Yeah, same I password. Okay. I'm now Ember. Nice. There you I, are. I forgot. Henry is a uh, gender specific. Right. Yeah, they're the opposite gender of your character. I've only seen boy Henry. <laughs> I've only seen girl Henry. Oddly enough, Dark Souls Three is like the only one where I played male characters exclusively. Gotcha. Greetings. Ooh, I've nice got square, my square sword. sword. <laughs> yeah. Let's go kill some crabs. All right. I'm just going to take a second and check side quests. Make sure I haven't okay. missed anything. Uh... <laughs> oh, I didn't... I didn't rescue Irina. No, I didn't do the thing in Firelink for her, but I can do that later. Okay. Got Anri. And Cirrus of the Sunless Realms should be at Firelink right now, too. Her name is Cirrus, and she will not be defeated. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, goodness. Trees. No trees, please. Right, these guys, they can kick your ass pretty easy. Which is a little unexpected, but they are using trees. Yes. Uh, I usually go this way first. Yeah? Okay, let's drop down here. Bloop. It kind of just loops around, but there's some extra items you can get this way. Gotta get all those items. I still okay. feel bad for the pale tongue I've missed somewhere. Oh no. It's not a big deal. Look, mushroom friends. Yay! Kill them before they spore us. Yeah. Before they drop their spores all over. Oh. Yeah. Sweet. Uh. Oh no, these ones don't even spore yet. They don't even have the poof ability. <laughs> I've been poisoned by these before. Yeah? Oh. Yeah, there we go. See? Just like you said, it happened. <laughs> oh no. There we go. It's alright. Uh, did you want some moss? <laughs> yeah, I don't have any right now. Okay. Help me! It's right here. Kind of hard to see. I'm fuzzing. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Delicious. That always makes you think of the a manly minor man Dark Souls video. If you've seen <laughs> that, 
It's lunchtime. La 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 lunchtime. <laughs> okay, did you want to fight Mr. Black Knight? Yes, but first I want to go this way. He just turns to look at you. Oh yeah, crunchy grapes are a great idea. Mm hmm. All right. Check this out. I'm not sneaky oh, no. at all. I accidentally walked forward. Oh, I wasted your pyromancy. Orbs. Oh, you poor fool. <laughs> Damn. Dual great swords is really fun. It is. And by that I mean having two people with great swords. Mm -hmm. Get your starting gear back here. <laughs> do you do you remember these pots, right? The ones that break and don't have physics? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> The flow of time is convoluted in Lothric. <laughs> oh, that's super cool. So cool. Oh my god. I'm cool with that. <laughs> oh, oh, too bad Cole isn't in the chat anymore. Or you could take this pun even further. Yep. We're thinking of you, Cole. Mm hmm. So, oh, that's giant crab. Yep. Giant enemy crabs. Hit the weak point for massive damage. Which you actually do. Yep. They probably didn't intend to reference that, but it's still fantastic either way. Oh my god. Why? Oh, Fire trees. I forgot about these guys. Behind you. Try that again. Look at you two hand in that beast. Like a beast. Um, I don't know if you can parry these guys. I'll try. Alright, that one will still get up. And attack you. <laughs> Hang on. Nope. Oh, goodness. Yeah, I don't think you can. Okay. Yeah, I keep making slurpy noises. Wait, you're making slurping noises? The, the, the tree man was. Yep. Oh, Onion's saying you can parry the spear guys. Okay. Well, shows how much I know. I don't know if this is true, but the Executioner Sword seems to swing faster than the Claymore. Um, we could do a test. So, uh, let's stand face to face. Okay, hang on. Yeah, once we're not in combat. Okay. Oh, uh... Alright, let's do a countdown. Okay. On go. Three, two, one, go. I think they're about the same. Also, we've got a yeah. person to deal with. <laughs> Hold on, I'll get this shiny. And right before the bonfire, too. Yeah. Oh, goodness. Orbs for the rescue. Yes. There he is. Lock on. Oh goodness. Oh god. 
I'm so bad at judging my range. What do you know? They're using a katana, just like every other invader we've encountered so far. It's almost like there's a meta. Yep. And again, I can't hit them. Mm. It's gotta be just like massive desync. Yeah. Well, if you're gonna heal. Yeah, that is free for all. They're going after me because they know I'm almost dead. Yeah, there we go. Oh, rip bell. Alright, I will be right back. Alright. Hello, Dar. fun part. Run away and chug! All that phantom hitbox, though. now before anyone else gets any ideas. Whew. I am back. Welcome back. Are you at the next bonfire? Yep. Alright, I'll go there and put my sign down. Okay, I'm just gonna hop to Firelink and get some levels. Because I barely eked out a win in that fight. Nice. Oh, hey, Geostar. Uh, does Embering make a difference to your health while you're a phantom? Or? No. It okay. ignores Embered status. Okay, I'll not bother then. Wait, do I get... I'm gonna... I'm gonna practice parrying those tree people. Hey, that's a good idea. Okay, so I just need to speak to Cirrus. I also need to speak to Hawkwood again. And Bring her the red pages. <laughs> I'm making mist references. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, okay. I've never played mist. I, I haven't either. I've just seen a let's play of it. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, you can like... Sort of absorb damage and prevent the knockback with the uh, imperfect parry. Yeah. Oh, uh, yes, Geostar, there is a band practicing in my basement right now. That's why you're hearing the music noises. Oh, really? That's interesting. Ah, good, wasn't he? Oh. I guess Embering does matter for certain phantoms. I mean, that's totally Dark Souls, just have it be completely arbitrary. Mm-hmm. Well, there's just... There's, like, tons of little 
things they've tried to do to balance it over the years. Wow. How? Okay, my sign is down by the Crucifixion Woods bonfire. Okay, I won't be too long. I'll put it down on, like, a route so it's easier to see. Yeah, I'll just spend my souls on the tower key. Okay. Always a good choice. I'm... And a dog spawned out of midair for me. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, champion of ash, I was not meant to be a firekeeper. The gods are oh my gosh, them. and it's making ragdoll noise constantly. I, <laughs> I love video games. Agreed. <laughs> oh, wow. Have a pleasant I'm having trouble judging distance because I'm playing in windowed mode now. Oh, you're not used to playing in windowed mode. Nope. I do like you can run, like, sprint backwards while you're locked onto something now. Oh yeah, you can do that. Oh, the log people drop tech night shards in case you were wanting to farm. Nice. Uh, I'm just gonna summon you in now, is that alright? Yep. Uh, hang on one second. Oh, there, I already right. summoned after you said yeah. No, no, that's fine. I could rest at the uh, bonfire <laughs> and get my health back. <laughs> huh, it's a throne. <laughs> Did you want to do a sneaky around the back of the building first or go into the swamp? Uh, let's sneaky around first. Alright. We can deal with the crabs later. Yeah. So when we're hungry for sushi. I like going. <laughs> um that guy didn't die for me and the dog spawned out of nowhere. Yeah. That I I'm getting some decent issues here. Well that happened for me too, which is the strange thing. I just screenshotted this dog is just kind of floating up into the trees. <laughs> it's, it's going back to its own planet. Yep. Doggy has ascended. Oh, there we go. Now things died. Here we go. <laughs> oh yeah, more souls. I'll take this guy. Alright. Fixed itself. Ooh, Esther Shard. Summon the purple phantom here, it is an NPC. Okay. We'll have to go back. Ow. But, yeah, the special effect of the Executioner Sword is that you gain focus points for this. So that's fueling my pyromancy. That's really good. Yeah. Oh, oh what are you doing, Guts? Stop that. <laughs> Bad tum-tum. Oh, I know that feeling. Alright, so apparently this guy here is an NPC. Let's see what happens. Let's see what we can see. Oh, it's Hodrick! Oh my gosh! Welcome back, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hi there. You <laughs> oh my God. dinkus. Thanks for the free backstab. Where do you find power within this? No idea. Well. Oh no! He only does like 8,000 damage a hit. <laughs> oh my god. We 
got trolled live on stream. Yep. 2016. Okay, putting my summon sign down again. <laughs> Pretty much. I kind of wish instead of a parrying dagger you could have like a sword breaker in these games as well. Isn't that pretty much what the parrying dagger is? Not quite. A sword breaker is like a short sword, but it's got like long notches in the side that you kind of catch the right. sword with. Whereas this is just kind of like the wrist guard is shaped so that you can catch a blade and push it away. It's just a small difference, but... Yeah, those teleporting dogs, though. <laughs> I guess that's just a feature now. It, they're blink dogs. <laughs> there you go. Eat them for telecontrol. Yep. Do we want to bother with Hodrick? Nah. I don't really care. Yes. I could switch to my raw claymore if you want. Nah, don't worry about it. He's just a dinkus anyway. Yeah. Dinkus doofus. Okay. Um. There's oh yeah, no if I jump down there, ball. then the crabs come. Did you want to do the closer boss or go to the, uh, the swamp? Uh, I say we should definitely do Crystal Sage. Okay. Okay. Yep. There's a lot of enemies here. That is the truth. Yeah. The, the stream happened and now we are in heck. I... I don't know how that worked. Hold still. <laughs> oh. Oh, nice. I might as well use these up. Yep. Gotta use up your whoops. My swoops. Yep. It's just a box. Nothing unusual about that box. Nope. Ow. <laughs> that keeps happening and I don't know why. I guess when they get knocked down it counts as a falling animation? I guess. Get the lizard. Alright, oh, then there's oh, this no. guy. Okay, I got the lizard. <laughs> good, good. Oh, from you and your silly traps. Look out! Bye bye. I can drop down here. Oof! I landed on your head. Fight, fight the poopy knights first. Oh yeah, poopy pants knights. And there's another bonfire over in that direction. I think there's a ledge we can get to. Yes. Hang on. Uh, back this way. Yeah. Uh, this way. Not that way. <laughs> okay. Oh, that was a worthwhile kill, though. I got an Estus up. Oh, nice. I think it is through here. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, I think we there's a friend it. here. Well, this yeah. Is no! All of his research! <laughs> <laughs> this is my study that you have to <laughs> 
Yes, this is your study, or I guess it was. How intriguing. That is my favorite thing to do in this whole game. Indeed, I am a sorcerer. That's the best shelf to destroy an entire game, too. Mm -hmm. What champion demands service without recompense? Clearly, you are not that sort There's of one better spot for rolling, but that's so not until later. That in exchange for my teaching. I guess this way is towards the crystal sage, so we might as well. Detailing sorcery secrets. Well. Very well. I take it you I am Orbeck. Unkin. Yes, Orbeck. Good boy. Go back to Firelink. Is there anything over here? I think this just drops down into the area below. Yep. Did you right. try to do the Crystal Sage right away? No reason not to. Okay. Oh, those zero casting time mages. Indeed. Uh, did you get the Mr. Hammer dude? The Mr. Hammer dude? The, 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 the guy who looks after the Faith Lady. It doesn't matter. His summon sign can appear. Oh, um, I guess not. Okay. <sighs> this boss. So purple. Remember purple. Okay. Always purple. Yeah. We should split up so we can be closer to where he can possibly spawn in. Okay. Good. Well, I got hit by something. Mm -hmm. Well, I heard the noises, but I can't see any of the Here other Here we go. Games. Yeah, I can only see the, the true mage. I can't see any of the other fake mages. Well, he's not making copies yet. Oh, really? He should be. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I gotta get him down to half health first. Oh, purple one. Oh, he lasered me. I'll go back to my side. Oh, it was? Okay. I didn't know that. I was holding in the wrong spot. Break your silly crystals. Get dead! Yeah! yeah. Hold on, I gotta put nap on my hotbar now. I've got a, I've got a bunch of emotes I can do now. <laughs> oh, does this mean I can't summon you for the crabs, or does this just no, a side not, boss? Not the crabs. You'll you'll have to, uh, I think, go to the the swamp area to summon me next? Oh, yeah. That's right. Let's see if I can find my way there. Oh my gosh! 
I can- I- my character has a voice. Yeah! Yeah, there's can... one emote that, uh, makes you yell. You go- you do the link, hey. It's cute. Okay, uh... Got some oh, crystal really? lizards. Can we backtrack from the cathedral? Or... Because we're going to fight the, the Faron knights next, probably. Oh boy. I mean, it would be if I knew where I was going. <laughs> I thought it worked like in Dark Souls 1, where you couldn't summon if you killed the boss yet. Well, let's find out. Okay, I'm just doing some leveling. Alrighty. Dexterity. Okay, that's interesting. Do NPC invaders still show up? Yeah, that's a good question. Uh... The staircase seems familiar. And another bonfire! Yay. Just what I need! Oh no, this leads on to the next, next area, I believe. Yeah, the cathedral. Not the shallow cathedral, though. <laughs> okay, I'm going back to that first era, the Crucifixion Woods bonfire, and I'll put my summon sign there again. Okay. <gasps> Crest shield is best shield. <laughs> See, oh no, it isn't. I want one with parry. They're all strike. Why is everything a strike shield? Uh, strike means you can parry. You're looking at the. Uh... Am I? Yeah. If you look at the. Oh thing below yeah. Strike. It'll be skill or parry. You are correct about this, as you often Press are. Press shield, parries. Okay, I'm happy then. Yep. All okay. is right with the world. Mm -hmm. Strike just means that's what happens if you wield it in your main hand. Right, that's the damage type it does. Yeah. Uh, did I grab the grass crest shield in my playthrough? I did. Okay. Haha, <laughs> I've got the ring, so. Sorry, not you. <laughs> it's okay, I'm a nerd. It's true. Already. So am I. I never I don't actually use it as an insult, it's just like, ha, we're all nerds. <laughs> okay, do I have Alright, is your summon sign down? It should be. Okay. Right on that same route. Hey, it's a Val. Nice. Excellent. So now we can kill some crabs. And some poopy knights. And get the grass crest shield. Mm -hmm. So I can become the ultimate uh, stamina haver of she... people. Mm hmm. Oh no! Doggy! Floaty dog! Nice. Oh. Floop that doggy. <laughs> Still hasn't died on my end. What? That's so strange. <laughs> this area seems to be bad with desync just because of how huge it is. I think it's just the dogs. It's like, bad dog sync. 
From Synchronize Your Dogs. Yes. Nope. Here we go. Hey, so. <laughs> hey! <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> okay, where are they? There we go, now the crap died. <laughs> Yay! Hey. Hey. Oh my god, talk about getting wrecked. <laughs> I thanks. Okay. Want to kill the rest of the crabs? Yeah. Get you a it's crab clobbering time. What? Oh no! Oh no! We got crab grab. Yep. That's fine. Though. That was, again, really weird desync. Not on my end. Nope. Yes! <laughs> I'll just stand inside the crab while you do that. I want to get the crab's eye view. Alright, there's also a place sort of underneath the building we can get to from here. Yeah, there's a bunch of a bunch of shit hidden around here. Yeah, it's a pretty big area. I'm at exactly 70% equip load. <gasps> Look, it's our friend! This guy! Yeah! Oh, they've got the, the, the ring on. That makes them not look like a phantom. Okay. I was a little confused there. Good. This is the most exciting part of invasions, where the invader just runs away. Yep. Definitely my favorite. <laughs> Good old fire orb. Ugh. Val, run away. Okay. Yay, we got a blue boy. No, no. Uh, we maybe not. Got a heal baby too, so. Uh. Oh. oh, this one healed too. Like you do. God, the fucking phantom range on that long sword. Healed again. Oh. I'm chasing them away. <laughs> Come on! 
please have my sword hit something. I'm gonna fight this little crab. I'm so sick of invasions. Completely and wholly. There, it's over. Okay, help. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh, heck. <laughs> Orf. Okay, I will put my summon sign back down at the spot. Alrighty. And I can lend you embers because I've got 20 of them now. Don't worry about it. It's Alrighty. it's just stupid that having a friend summon also puts you top of the queue for invaders. Oh really? Yep. Aww. Is it still a limit to four people? I don't know. Because I'm still in the way of the blue. I should be sun growing right now. To be honest. No, it doesn't matter. Nothing really matters. <laughs> God, I just... <sighs> uh, just tech. It's not having to fight invaders. It's not getting killed that bothers me. It's the stupid rolling bullshit. That's what I was doing too, to be honest, because I don't have a shield. Well, you have to. It's either yeah. you roll constantly, or you just die immediately. Especially with the yep. phantom range on long swords. Okay. There's like a one area under here with some goodies. I think there might be a sorcery scroll. Let's check it out. I'm just going to fluke my cape everywhere. Do you see that? <laughs> Yep. Where it, like, gains momentum the more I floop. <laughs> Wretch Maya. Wow. Hey, Ang... Ang... Ang Swiss? Hello. Oh, they got the... Milk ring. Oh, is this a person? Yeah. Great. Because like we didn't have enough of these assholes. Okay, I'm gonna go in for a stun with my rolling attack. I need okay. you to be ready to uh, hit them after that. I mean, that works, too. Yeah. No, it's a crab. Yup. Get the dry land. Oh, I shouldn't have chugged. They didn't chug. I broke the rules. Oh, no, they did chug. <laughs> And change first. Okay, I didn't want to play the game. I just wanted to roll around for 10 minutes. 
Dark rolls. Yep. <sighs> well, if we beat them, it'll put a cooldown on invasions. Not if I die, though. In which case, it's just like you get invaded again, immediately. Yeah. Can you tell I'm bitter? A little. Ah, oh, tiny crab, why? Oh. oh no, we've got the poopy knights. Everything's going wrong. Welcome to Dark Souls 3. Everything's going wrong. <laughs> oh my god, they actually did it. jumping down and killing myself. Oh no. Uh, I'm sorry, Val. I don't think we should co-op in this area anymore. Okay. Uh, not this area anyway? Yeah. Yeah, this is kind of the worst area for invasions. Just butts. And not taters. I'm wondering if we being such a high level this is what this is well. Later, Onion. No, it's literally just having any summon. Alrighty, well, let me know when you can uh, summon me again. Later, Onion. I don't even know. Maybe I should take a break, because I'm getting really pissed off. Aww. And I forgot to do my death counter. Oh no. I think that was number 12. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, I'm just going to head back to the bonfire. Okay. Oh. Well, thanks for joining me anyway. It was fun until the game decided that we shouldn't have fun anymore. Yeah. Uh, I'll let you know next time when when I need your assistance. Sure. Is this the end of the stream? Yeah, I'm just gonna level up and then okay. turn it off for the night. Alright. Well, it's been fun, even though it was short. Yeah. I will see everyone later. Later, Val. Have a good night. You too. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Hey, sorry that it had to end as soon as you got here, Eternus. Or shortly after. Hmm. You know what? Maybe I'll do the I'll do the firelink thing real quick. 
because I've unlocked the ability to go upstairs now, and that's exciting. Did I talk to Hawkwood? Oh yeah, he's talking about the Legion now. Where's that staircase? I hope you haven't uh, closed your Twitch window yet, because we've still got a few minutes of content. Oh, there's a seed of a giant tree. That might be useful. Yeah, just keep screaming, guys. <laughs> They're having fun. I wish I could, too. I really feel like just... Just so many of the design decisions in, the game, in this game are the anti-fun. And, uh... I feel it even more after going back to Dark Souls 2. Let's see, I'm gonna shoot... Oh no, that goes up! Whoops. I'm gonna need to call it back. You should practice ukulele, Josephine. Especially in light of the game that's going to be coming out at some point. Featuring characters with very similar names to that instrument. I think you know what I'm talking about. I'm not in Dark Souls 3 for sure. Dark Souls 1 and 2, they were fine with you having fun. This one, I think, like, they got their heads too shoved up their own asses as far as, we must make the most difficult game ever, yes, nah, this is what the people want, I'm now Skeletor. <laughs> you know? Okay, so there's a Firekeeper soul up here. Uh, those, those do a thing in this game. If I'm remembering right. That's pointless, so we will just not. Let's see. Yeah, that's a long jump. I guess it'll be okay. Right, this isn't Dark Souls 2 fall damage. It's a lot more forgiving. Aw. Oh, there's my sippy. And the Estus Ring. Makes your sippy even sippier. What? Where'd you... Oh, right, it's this guy. Well, Dragon Man, you wanted me to fight the Master at some point. I guess we're gonna do that now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you having fun down there? No! Get shrekt. Not me! I wasn't supposed to get shrekt. Um, 
I don't know, Eternus. Play the games if you want to. But, like... You don't, you don't have to prove anything by playing Dark Souls. You really don't. I know there's a big section on the internet where we're all like, Oh, if you don't play Dark Souls, you're not a real... You're not a real pizza mancer. Because you can shoot the pepperoni out of your butt. But they're just stupid people on the internet. They honestly do not matter. That said, like, if you if you absolutely want to play through them, then fucking go for it. Rock some Dark Socks. On that note, I'm not sure why I'm playing this. No, it's because, uh... It's because I wanted a series I can do on Twitch. Where I don't have to think about what game I'm going to play next. Fuck off. I want something I can come back to for a while. I figure Dark Souls 3 will do just fine. For such purposes. Okay. I'm glad he's taken care of. And then there's this item, which I missed last time, too. It's just kind of floating there. Conspicuous, but not so conspicuous that you can't miss it. Which means I'm definitely going to miss it. Yeah, I'd love to be a pizza mancer. I think Grums is like pretty high level pizza mancer now. Not only does he make the pizzas, he brings them to your door. Oh no. Oh, I was about to make a joke about your misspelling, but then you corrected it. Yeah, but I got that one, Dragon Man. I got that one. Also, hey, Zarf. Sorry to say uh, I'm going to be cutting the stream pretty soon. Rage quitting and all that. But it is nice to see you anyway. Hopefully I get to do a few more streams this week. I'm just not... I'm not thinking I'll have the energy working, like, 11-hour days installing floors. Because that shit's pretty draining. You, you. Remember all the birds from the other games? Me, me, pickle pea. This one's Pickle Pea. Me, me, bum -bum. You said it, little one. Uh, I don't even know... I don't remember what you can trade, so... We'll do that another time. I've just got a few more things to clean up in the fire links here. Aww. Yeah, I never wait to eat. Somebody's late and dinner's on the line. That's their loss. There, I thought there was an item on this ledge somewhere. I guess not. There's an item on this ledge. It might be this part of Firelink specifically that makes me think of Demon Souls so much. Because there was a lot of hidden stuff way up high in the Nexus, I believe they called it. That's the one. By the way, this wall, it's not really there. Spooky! It's 
See the chain on this one? It's a real chest. Oh, yes. Give me more souls. Is there any other hidden walls here? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it's not the case. I think we've discovered all the secrets now. But I think Katana Man gave me enough for one more level up. Welcome home, Russian speaker. Do I want to give her the Firekeeper soul? Oh, Onion left, so you can't tell me what's what. Why, Onion? In the time I needed you most, you're gone. Yeah, I'm gonna put points into luck stat. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe I'll bump up my faith a little bit. Let's give her the Firekeeper soul. Ashen One, this is much like what lies within me. Then let it find its own place within my bosom. She will understand. We are both fire keepers after all. Hey, hey sister. May the flames guide thy way. Not that I'm ever going to do that, but it's nice to have the option. In fact, I think I might have enough new deaths to get another level up. Oh, and Grey Rat's back. Hey, buddy. Oh, hello. You've come at a good time. It took some prowling, but I finally made a score. Go on, have a gander. Can I have a goose? What do we got here? I think the Zweihander is new. Maybe the Bastard Sword. Definitely these assassin armors here. But yeah, we'll, we'll keep uh, buffing up his inventory as we send him out to loot and hopefully not get him killed immediately. But we'll just have to see how that goes. Oh, our champion of Ash. I would do any. Then shall we begin? Bearer of the Dark Sign. Okay, I got one more. No, I'm doing faith. I believe in the faith. Be safe. I guess I could also give my tomes to Irina? Irana? The blind lady. The one with all the dark creep curly bugs. And there's Cornix, who I've just ignored this whole time. I wish to express my gratitude for trusting the lowly pyromancer and allowing me to gaze upon this majestic flame. As promised, I will impart pyromancers to you. But first, you need a flame of your own. Careful you don't burn yourself with it. <laughs> <laughs> what a funny guy. Got any cool items? Oh, you've got the new pyromancer set. Yes, here we are. It's been long indeed. With this, I can teach you more sophisticated pyromancies. Splendid. I can boast I am your tutor a little longer. It's true, Josephine. What is it? <laughs> Everybody's a little strange in Dark Souls Town. Oh, you're back then, again. I'm Orbeck of Benheim. Let us begin with the basics. The ideal sorcerer bears the twin faces of the dragon. Oh, you could at least act as if you're paying attention. But I care so much about learning sorceries on my faith build. You Come just again. have to trust me. Oh, Champion of Ash. Welcome back. Do you wish to hear a tale? You only have to ask. Let's see, do you got anything cool for me? Oh, hey! Yeah! Oh, 
You've brought me a braille divine tome. And now I can tell new tales of miracles. Tales of the greater miracles can be quite the epics. What fun we will have. <laughs> It'll be a regular old party. A journey, I pray for you. The funny thing is, if you talk to her before getting a tome, she'll be like, Oh, I'm sorry, I can only read the braille tomes. But then you find braille tomes everywhere. Maybe... Maybe all of the faith healers are blind. Hmm. Anyway. Uh, that's, that's pretty much the end. Oh no, I can buff up my Estus Flask too. <laughs> just... If I can hit the two hour mark by futzing around and doing minor things. Today will have been a good day. Any more? No. You can give him coal. Oh my. This coal is I'm pretending to be Santa. You've been a naughty boy, Andre. Used to forge the weapons of Farron's Abyss Watchers. A fine prize. I'm honored to be endued with it. Now I'll be equipped to infuse special gems. Praise the gods, eh? Time to put this brawn to use. <laughs> you said it. Uh, I'm going to start needing large titanite to upgrade my claymore now. Well, Josephine is a really nice coal. I guess. Weapons and protection when open. Right. Durability is a thing. Don't forget. Hey, Bazooka Tooth. Uh, today's been interesting. Oh, hello, hand in one. I killed a boss, so that's good. And then invasion spam happened, and I was like, no, I'm done with this. So I'm just kind of doing a few random things, wasting time. Goodbye. <laughs> Sorry to say I won't be streaming too much longer now. Okay, I think I think that is actually everything to do. Except for attuning my proper heal spell. Ah yes, for self and vicinity, that's what I want. Hey buddy, I know that feel. Well, thank you all for coming to this uh, impromptu Monday stream. Hopefully I can do more during the week, but I unfortunately can't promise anything right now. Uh, until then, take care and enjoy your sippies.